So it's it's not that women are not allowed any longer to shake hands with men or they have to shake hands with men on the street or elsewhere, but it's when it comes to a sort of secular ceremony. Um, so it's the same idea where you can't wear a veil and be a judge, for example, you know, the banning of conspicuous religious symbols in schools, for example, you can't be a teacher because, or wear the cross or the kippah, because these are all ways of, uh, e even if it's subtly proselytizing in a, in a, in a, setting that has to be completely secular the state has to be ignorant in a way of a religion so i think that's where this handshake uh, ban is coming from yeah. is that a lot of secularists in france have argued including um, many secularists from muslim backgrounds who are atheists or seculars they've said that there was never even a need for the the sort of banning of conspicuous religious symbols and so on and so forth because those laws already exist in france because since the early 1900s, the law with the separation of the church from the state um, mm -hmm. already uh, didn't allow for religious, any religious symbols in, uh, you know, uh, in areas which were state uh, sponsored or run by the state, like the courts, like the schools. And so it does apply, in fact, and that's what a lot of secularists are saying, that this is not a hijab ban. It's a ban on religious symbols. And Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim-majority countries, advocating for atheists, secularists, and Enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash S-J-M-E.